Oh, oh what? no, yeah, because Josh plus Demix equals Josh's freak out during his boss battle. Yeah, that's true, Samurai. That is definitely true. And you were a lucky Ellie. Who the hell sat on the right whoopee cushion? What? I heard a fart sound. Like, did somebody sound? That was me. Cushion? No, that was me. I snorted. Uh, oh. I snorted that with the, the whoopee laugh. cushion. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, I have a weird laugh. <laughs> no! Oh, twice I failed Oops. to do that spin jump. Whoopsie! Oh god, another one. Ooh! I like the background in this one. The seat, the area in this one is pretty. Let's see. Hey, Jaggy's with Ari right now. Damn it! Ah. Uh, well, they're roommates for the time. I being. have the best fiance ever. Just want to point <laughs> that out. <laughs> okay, carry on. <laughs> Shoot her! Shoot her! <laughs> I know, right? That's what's going on here. Shoot her! <laughs> Shoot! Jurassic Park God joke. damn it! <laughs> hey, I love Bubba that. Uh, I love that Jurassic Park joke. <laughs> Jurassic Park is thriving in the dark. All, All the, the dinosaurs are running, are running wild. wild. God fucking <laughs> damn it! <laughs> <sighs> okay, this is a. I got a question for you guys. You know how, like many of us, growing up especially as kids, we have these little crushes on video game characters? Mm-hmm. What was yours? Mm. Mm. I, I already- I, I'll tell you mine to give you a head start. Mine was Ocarina Time Adult Link. Well, I mean, that's just easy. Yeah. <laughs> well, <laughs> it's, it's the fucking but, hair. And that was like my first freaking video game crush. Hmm. My very Who first one. Who did I have crushed? I don't know. How did yeah, I, I didn't try really to... get crushes. Mm. Uh, the thing is, okay, when <laughs> when my folks found out that I had a crush on him. My dad poked fun at me nonstop about it, and I'm like, "Dad, shut up!" <laughs> he liked to tease me a lot when I was a kid. Uh, if you had that kind of hair, Dad, maybe Mom would crush on you more. Oh! 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 Freaking savage! I could just imagine Ellie. This is like, this is her every other Tuesday. <laughs> I, I just say stuff. I don't even think about it. <laughs> it was just too perfect. Oh. <sighs> <sighs> I'm legit struggling here. I can't think of... No, I can think... I don't know if this is my first one, and it is kind of lame because... It... Because, well, Edgelord emo is sort of bullshit. But Vincent... Now, Vincent from Final Fantasy VII. Really? Yeah. Ah! No, don't spill! Oh my god, I almost spilled strawberry seltzer all over my laptop. Oh god! Be forever. careful, Holly! Oh, Goodness my god. gracious! Ugh, oh, where'd the cap go? Shit! I can't even close it now! Oh no! Oh no! It legit disappeared! What the fuck? How did it disappear? I don't know. I I hit it with my arm when I was trying to capture catch the seltzer before it fell. And now it's gone. And somebody's echoing like a fuck. Ah shit. I don't that know. Be... I think it I think it's CG. Um Are you wearing headphones, CG? Let me put them on. Yeah, oh. <laughs> thought so. Um when the kid <laughs> <I said> from, uh... <laughs> What? 
What? Mr. Analog's like, Ellie, rolling nat 20s on saving throws since ever. Ugh. Damn it. <laughs> But, uh, I when, after my little silly crush with Link from uh, the Legend of Zelda series, uh, another one that I ended up having a little silly crush on, I'm trying to remember who it was. Oh yeah, now I remember. It was Squall from Final Fantasy VIII. You like them pretty boys, don't you? Leon? What can I say? You mean Leon? I like the pretty one. No! Squall from Final Fantasy, not Leon from Kingdom Hearts. Don't His get name was stuff. Squall Leon Hart. Yes. Yeah, he's like, yeah, Leon. <laughs> uh, uh. Yes, he was, um, <laughs> he was one of those, and I couldn't help it. I had a thing for pretty boys as a kid. I don't know why. I just did. Maybe because they were pretty. <laughs> but then again, later just on. Just a thought. Okay, I but think then I'm when starting I, um, to set a pattern here. No, 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 then when I ended up getting into like anime and such, eventually nope, I ended up having a crush not. on Vegeta. <laughs> Why Vegeta? He's an asshole. No, he doesn't because become Because some one, people one. like assholes. That's why. Vegeta's <laughs> such a vegetable. Okay, dude, the way you said that, you sounded like you said some people lick assholes. Ew! <laughs> Ew! <laughs> I bet the thing is, that statement would still be correct. Yeah. <laughs> I'm kind of, yeah. You just made her cringe so hard. Then again, I also ended up having a silly crush on Batman, but then again, that's kind of expected. <laughs> Batman. It's Batman. It's Batman. What do you expect, right? Yeah. Uh, he is called the Playboy for a reason. <laughs> and it's not because he owns a mansion. Oh no, it is much more than that. He knows how to charm his women. Mm. Uh, then again, it doesn't help that the fact that Kevin Conroy, who voices the animated Batman, has such a freaking attractive voice. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna have to look this up. All right. Um. Yeah. You know, that's one cool thing that happened to me. I admit that this is something cool that um, Toon Critic did while we were dating. He got Kevin Conway to say happy birthday to me. Aww. I actually got to meet the dude in person. Now I'm jealous, and I hate you. <laughs> hey, to be fair, there's a lot of people I wish I got to meet in person, and I envy everybody mm. who's gotten to meet them. You know who I wish I could have met? Monty Ohm. Okay, I need to think of who this guy is. Monty the Ohm. creator the creator of Ruby. Oh, okay, yeah. Okay. I was so sad Things when I heard he passed away. Freeze. Oh, you have oh, to try no! to freeze the head Damn! while it's open mouth. Oh, oh, yeah, he passed away years ago. Who passed like, away? Like, he had an old... Uh, Monty Ohm. Hmm. No, he... He had complications, like an allergy to a medicine while he was in the hospital, and he passed. Aww. That's a bummer. And <laughs> Season, I might have to agree with you. <laughs> On one of those. Okay, um, <laughs> Sebastian, yeah. Fuck. I'm not gonna <sighs> lie, that voice That's is so timing, freaking... though. That was definitely impeccable <laughs> timing, wasn't it? Mm -hmm. Yes, it was. I'm not gonna lie, that voice is so freaking attracting. I'm it's simply hard one to not... hell of a butler. Oh, yes. <laughs> yes he is. <laughs> the way you emphasize butler. What? That's exactly how he said it. I know. No, but... DG's making a dumb joke. Yeah, butler. Mm -hmm. <sighs> DG, I am You're going to get hard. you. You if we want to too hard. If we want to talk about asses, let's start with you. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well played. God damn it! Oof. Get up there. That's yeah. what he said. Oh wait, wrong one. <laughs> Get up there. <laughs> I say things without thinking about them. That was out of my mouth before I even thought about it. <laughs> uh huh. Sure. <laughs> it was. I swear. I forget who voices Alucard in the uh, English dub of Helsing. I forget who the voice actor is. Darn it! No! No, 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 no! 
Whoosh, wingy, wink, whoosh. Who voices Alucard? Alaprachta. Crap! Now I forgot who voices Alucard! Um, but the voice actor for Alucard, I cannot resist either. Oh, I don't know. Okay, Ellie, since I know you played Persona 5 as well, I want to mm -hmm. see if you would if you realize this. In the very beginning, when you hear Arsene speak, did you recognize the voice? No. <laughs> I did. I don't recognize voice actors very easily. Okay. I actually Arsene... have a lot of tr I actually have a lot of trouble with voices, so. That's fair. <laughs> well, here's a little fun fact. The Analog, let's Arsene... try not to drop names. Yes, let's not. Well, what? Um, but, okay, the voice, the voice actor who voiced Arsene in Persona 5, it's the voice of Alucard from Helsing. Well, that's why I didn't recognize it, I didn't watch Helsing. Oh, uh, Jess, um, his name was Chris oh, thank you, Desert Freeman. Freeman. Oh, yeah, yeah I remember thank you, that Desert guy. Summer. Yeah, he oh, also he? voices Arsene, he's a amazing voice actor. He can get into a character real easily. Uh, excuse me. Nice. <laughs> That's not a challenge, oh. don't even. There, um, there was one guy I, I met in person that I finally got to meet, and I'm hoping to meet the rest of the cast of this particular game series. I got to meet the voice of Mario! Oh, um... That's cool. I, I know who you're talking about, um... Yeah. Charles, I forget Charles Martinet. Thank you. Charles yes. Martini? No, Martin... <laughs> She got it. <laughs> <laughs> Martini. God dang it, Ellie. But yes, I got to meet him in person, and holy crap, he's the freaking sweetheart. As of he's, this like the, he's like the freaking is. Uh, he's like a freaking sweetheart when I met him in person. Like, oh my god, he's such a sweet man. Oh, you should. Oh, okay. One of the people that was walking around at this convention where he was, they had like this huge Yoshi plushie riding in this little um, wagon that look that they decorate to look like Yoshi's cart. It was cute. When he saw it, he freaked out in excitement. He's like, "Can I have a picture of it?" Okay, oh. that's adorable. Oh, look who's in the chat. <laughs> uh. Uh, yeah, I kind of sent him a link to the stream. Why did you... Uh, okay. It's Gold... It, it, it's okay, Goldie. It's okay. It's just Luna Corva. Hi, Luna Corva. <laughs> God damn it. Yeah, that's my reaction, too. <laughs> but, yeah. And, um, he got to... Oh, I had him fuck. Up. Sign uh, my what box. The Try fuck? to freeze the queen's head while it's uh, line up with the ground and activate into a morph ball and roll into the mouth while it's open. Yeah, hey, it wait. almost seems impossible. Yes, he did. <laughs> oh my fucking god. Here we go again. No, that's not lightning. That's Bliss. Jesse. Ah! <laughs> How many times are people gonna confuse me with Blissy? <laughs> <laughs> Triggered. Triggered, Kieran. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Season, for cheering me up. Hey kids, wanna see a dead body? <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> Helsing a bridge. Season of the Wicked mentioned that, and I was like, yep. Hey kids, wanna see a dead body? Okay. Oy, 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 oy. Luna Corva, I don't blame you if you don't know who Jessie is, but she's a friend of ours. She's really, cu she's really cool. She has the cutest daughter of all time. And she sounds just like Lightning Bliss, and she hates it. Yes. 
you'll uh, okay you'll get a chance to know me more when golden fox does his review of sounds of silence because i'm gonna be cameo cameo in it yeah i hear it too ah. wait yeah uh i didn't really talk too much about it but yeah uh she's gonna cameo in that and uh, her yeah and her daughter's gonna be included and it's gonna be a running joke oh my yes. god stroke you're gonna love you're going to love it. <laughs> wait. Wait, what's going on? Um, okay, I, but... okay, so um, me and Rose Pal plan to do a review of The Sounds of Silence. It's taken a bit oh. because I'm still uh, obtaining the uh, vectors of uh, me and Rose as Kieran. I've spoke <laughs> to Trailblazer for that. It's going to be quite a budget whenever the time comes. Um, there's a good chance that we'll be starting off with it after BronyCon. Because it's 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 gonna be quite a budget. Um, but oh yeah. Ba yeah, but, uh, yeah. Basically, Jesse, I uh, gave the idea of having her make a first appearance, and I had this funny idea that while she makes her um, makes her appearance, Yandera yeah, Jesse. <laughs> <laughs> what? What? Dear staff replacement, I want to send you Jeez. this friendly little letter to inform you your of oh your my imminent God. demise. If you're curious about the frequency of which I've sent these letters, it is merely to instill as much fear as I can as if facing a turkey, which I will then proceed to have s What <laughs> What the heck? What the heck? What the fuck? <laughs> I I know where this is from, but <laughs> no! <laughs> oh, curse my imagination! Oh no! No, oh, I'm never no, gonna no. unsee. No, I'm never gonna unsee Alucard stuffing the turkey. Oh no! Oh no! You! Oh no! See, <laughs> look what you've done! <laughs> I'm never gonna unsee that. Okay, Desert Semi, I used to play Yu-Gi-Oh! a long time ago when I was younger. I kind of retired from it because, um, my daughter- Fuck. I have a daughter. I might get back into it, but if I had to choose what deck I ended up being to answer Derek DeBronis' question, um, I would probably be wanting to try working more with the Gem Knight deck. So Ooh, I really did good choice. Yes, I really enjoyed the idea and design for the character for the de for the cards themselves when it came to that deck, and it was very easy to figure out real fast. So yeah, gen knights are really easy to use because fusions. Yep. I like a roam mage. Yes, I noticed. <laughs> I Nobody her... else likes my aroma mage. <laughs> I just heard Harambe. I, I see you make a joke, call me a yandere! I am no yandere! I at am best, not a yandere! At best, she's a sundere. I was gonna say, yeah. <laughs> soon, a soon. A sundere. <laughs> soon, soon. I'm... Oh, wow. Okay, I have to look this, like, uh, find another way of looking this up. Wait, what the heck? Okay, I don't get what Luna is talking about. Just be careful of power creep there, Jess. Uh, what? Yeah, um, really? decks will become obsolete as more archetypes are released. That's what power creep is. Oh, okay. Uh, David Ayandere, to basically put it, is somebody who has such a strong obsession with something, and they would go through every links to making sure that nothing happens to this thing they are obsessed with, so that it can be at theirs. Theirs and theirs alone. Sometimes, it gets really bloody. That's game... all I got to say. There's a game called the Andre Simulator that I'm following the development of, and it looks yes. like it's going to be really cool. I know what you're talking about, too. I've seen a lot of people play that thing, and like, good god. Yeah, it's going to get gruesome, which is part of why it's going to be awesome. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, I, when it comes to Yu-Gi-Oh, I kind of retired from it because my daughter and all that stuff, so. Priorities. Matt Keto, 
My kiddo took most of my priority more than Yu-Gi-Oh. Oh well. It, I say that's a proper priority. Yes. Okay. Hmm. I'll definitely keep that in mind if I do try to get back into it. <laughs> yes, they are. Yandere's are also very psycho stalker. There is one anime that is a big example of that. And it's terrifying. <laughs> Oh. Oh, Faith! Hi, Faith! Faith. Hi, Faith! It's a Faithy! Hey, Faith, my buddy! Oh, Faith Star. Hey. Yee! So, I, I'm. So, I'm looking. Like, I've looked up a video, I've looked up web pages on how to take on the Queen. It's. Um. I don't get it. I mean, they make Are it look you? easy, but still, like, what the hell? Hmm. 